Hey guys, I'm over back again. This is going to be a quick video on the January update for the Google Pixel 7. I know the December update was a pretty big one that brought pre-VPN, speaker, labeling on the recording app, and a whole bunch of other features. This one looked like it's just a minor software tweaks, optimization, fixing security bugs, and little things like that. But one thing that did catch my attention is it looks like more users are experiencing Bluetooth issues especially with certain car models and there's a reddit thread out there about it it looks like people try to reach out to google it takes like a day or two to hear back and one of the solu one of the solution that, that google offered was to send the phone back in this is not always ideal for most people to have to send the phone in anytime there's an issue this method implied that you do need like a backup phone which a lot of people don't always have and i remember in the early days when one of my commenters were having issues they had to send their phone in google did eventually send them a new phone but i just wish there was a easier way to fix it without having to send your phone in. But just look into this article on 9 to 5 Google. It just looks like the issue is predominant on a Google Pixel 7, but some people have experienced it on a Google Pixel 6 and also the 6 Pro. And it seems like this most recent update is the one that is causing the issue. Some people have had the 6 Pro for over a year and their Bluetooth worked fine. It wasn't until the recent update that they can no longer connect to their car and Android Auto is having an issue with this most recent update. I know if you go inside of the uh, developer settings and you play around with the map version, change it to 1.2, that may or may not help. But it's worth a shot if you're still having issues. I no longer have my Pixel 7, so I can't really test it out, but I do want to continue to monitor and see how Google keep up with the updates, how they're resolving these issues. Google talk a big game about the software updates, making sure that it's gonna be consistent with their monthly security updates. And this happens all the time with any manufacturers. Sometimes when you push out a new update, you end up breaking other things. Hopefully they will fix it in the next update. And another issue I do want to touch on is the camera glass shatter issue. I have read that it's becoming more of a concern. I'm not sure if anyone is experiencing it. It's just the back camera is magically shattering in a perfect circle around the lens. You would think it's a user issue, but if multiple people are complaining about the same exact thing and it's breaking the same way, it's not a thing to track and monitor. I haven't heard Google address it yet, but between the camera lens magically shattering and the Bluetooth issues starting to hear more and more complaints. The Pixel 7 was a great phone when I was using it, but I'm curious to see how it's gonna age over time. I think it will be fine though. The Bluetooth issue can be fixed with a software update. Hopefully Google does it sooner rather than later. If I still had the phone, this would definitely be really inconvenient for me. Just because the fact that I'm always driving around listening to Bluetooth music, using Google navigation and all that. So I totally get it and there's a huge reddit thread on it. I think it's affecting a lot of users. Just making this video to create awareness and generate some conversation. Let me know if any of you guys are experiencing the issue since the January update. Some things you can do is try to unpair, just go into Bluetooth setting, forget everything, try to repair. It may or may not work, but still worth a shot. Try to troubleshoot it, see how it goes. Play around with the developer option and the map version, see if that helps. If not, fingers crossed until the next update. Hopefully Google fix it. Thanks for watching guys. Please check out my daily vlogs if you haven't already and see you guys in the next video.